In this demo, I'm a full stack developer onboarding to a new team. I had previously been working on the front end team, but after a recent project wrapped up, I'm moving over to the back end team. I want to contribute quickly. Let's see how GitLab Duo Agent Platform can help me get started making an impact on day one. Here I'm in the Savings Transactions project. To get started, I'm going to open Duo Agentic Chat and ask it for some help. I'll start with a simple prompt. Can you help me understand this application? I'm new to the team and want to get started contributing right away. After I enter the prompt, Duo Agentic Chat will get to work. It starts by scanning the project, searching through the different directories and reading the different files. Instead of reviewing all of these individual files and piecing the connections together myself, Duo Chat covers that for me. When it's done, it will provide me with a lot of really helpful information. Here, I can get the application overview. It explains the tech stack we're using. It's a Spring Boot application handling savings account transactions. I also see the core functionality, code details, the data model, and it even gives me tips on how to get started contributing. This is a great start and helps me get up to speed really quickly on my new team. Next, I'm going to use one of Duo Agent Platform's foundational agents, Duo Planner, to find a way to contribute today. Foundational agents come out of the box supported by GitLab and have deep domain-specific expertise and context awareness. They're integrated into chat, but are designed to provide specialized workflows. The Duo Planner agent is specifically designed for product management and planning use cases. I'll ask Duo Planner for help identifying a good first issue to work on. When I enter my prompt and engage the planner agent, it uses a specialized system prompt and tool set focused on planning, planning capabilities to help answer my questions. This agent starts to provide me with recommendations. You can see it recommends issue 10 to get familiar with the code base. For now, I'll take its advice. I go to the issue list and I find issue 10. Let's review it. I see there's two proposed solutions. After reviewing the solutions, I like option one better. So I'll edit this issue description and remove option two. That way it's clear that we're going with option one. I'll also make a couple other minor edits. Next, I can use one of GitLab's agentic AI features called the issue to MR flow. With the click of a button, a workflow is kicked off to create an MR and implement a solution for this issue. While that's happening, I'll keep learning about my new project. Since I'm working on a banking application, security is critical. I'll use another one of GitLab's foundational agents, the security analyst agent. This agent can help me dig deep into the security elements of this project. Here I will prompt one of the priorities for making this project more secure. Security analyst agent is another foundational agent that's built and maintained by GitLab and designed to maximize the impact of GitLab's security capabilities. After prompting and asking for some guidance, I'm getting a great readout here on what's going on in this project. I see the top priorities and some recommended immediate actions to take. So here I am on day one, new to this team, new to this project, and I'm able to get insightful explanations of everything that's going on across the projects from a security perspective, and as you saw earlier, on the planning side. This helps me contribute right away because of GitLab's capabilities and the foundational agents built into the platform. So now I'll go into the agent sessions dashboard. This is where recent AI sessions are accessed. You can see a few sessions. I'm going to look at the issue to merge request session I just initiated. This is the issue about aligning the Java version in the application. In this session, all of the details, all of the context about what's going on with these agents, all of that is shared here. This is really helpful for learning and understanding, especially on a new project. I can go in, I can see all the different planning steps, decisions, and actions that were taken by the agent. As I scroll, scroll down, I'll get to the bottom and find the merge request that was created. I'm gonna open that merge request. I can look at the changes and see that there's a few small changes to my Docker file and readme. Just a few minutes in, and I'm already contributing to my new team. I certainly don't wanna merge anything on my first day on this new team, so I'll assign this merge request to my teammates so they can review and merge if approved. I will also assign GitLab Duo as a code reviewer. 
This can help speed things up for my teammate once they have a chance to look at this. And now you see GitLab Duo is doing its review. And here's the review. This will give my teammate a great place to start on their review when they have a chance to look at this. You can see how all of these AI agents, agentic chat for code base understanding, duo planner for prioritizing work, security analyst for risk awareness, and the autonomous issue to MR agent for implementation have helped me make an impact on day one. I'm off to a great start on my new team at Tanuki Bank thanks to GitLab Duo agent platform.